So, the question is, how's the quality? It looks like we're live, though, and you are actually first. And you can't see me. So let me know how it looks. Ew, this lighting is weird back here, but... Is it, like, pixelated? Is it good? Because last time I did it on my phone, it was really bad quality. So let me know. Also, hi. <laughs> It's fine. But is it good? I need more than just fine. A little blurry. Um, I think I'm... I might change it. Hold on. It might disconnect you. So in like five seconds you might get disconnected, just join back if, it, if something happens. Are we still here? Did it kick you off? Is, okay, let's see. <laughs> no, no. So, I don't know what you're saying no to. Oh, it's still here? Does it look any better? Hopefully it looks better now. I'm using cell service, so it's probably gonna cost more money. <laughs> um, so, show us Sunny. Well, we're here for a different animal. As someone does ask, but the message is going too fast. My Kenyan Sanbo is in such a lame thing. Let me show you it. Turn you around. So I'm redoing this uh, in a 20 gallon. This is my Kenyan Sanbo Ember. It's, just look at how boring it is. Just a piece of plastic and a bowl that dries out in a day. Um, so I'm redoing this, there's tape on my foot, uh, redoing this thing in a 20 gallon with a bunch of Zoomed stuff. Cause you might remember, it's on the floor cause my new shelving hasn't arrived. Uh, this is Sunny's enclosure. I need to clean it up a little cause he pulled that out. Um, but ZoomMed sent me all the products for this, and it was, I think it came out really well along with the video. So they agreed, oh, and I have to clean that up. It's been a couple days since I cleaned it. Um, but luckily they agreed to help me out with another build. So that'll be soon. But this part will probably take a little while because I'm going to be using the ex excavator clay, which is this. I've never used it. So we'll see how it goes. And yes, I remember the the dirty heat pits. Thanks for reminding me. Um, and then this is the enclosure I'm gonna do it in. It's just a 20 long. It, it's really old, and I just sharpied it to mark where I'm gonna be doing parts. Um, so it took forever to scrub. You can still see some water spots. If it, maybe you can't see them. Hopefully you can't see them, because it's been a while cleaning it. Uh, you haven't really missed anything yet. We haven't done much. So it is kind of messy. Here's, I feel like I shouldn't show stuff yet, but here's some other products we're using for the build. Uh, this is not the Zoomed product, but I'm going to have everything linked in the full video. So this is... <clears throat> um, if you saw... Did, were you any, or, did any of you see the other stream when I filmed Sunny's background? That might be this will turn out to be just a different background. I did, I think I did two streams for that and it took forever. It was a few months ago. And I'm going to be trying to record at the same time. So we'll see how that goes. I do record parts of it though. Oh, a lot of you saw that, okay. Well, we can try and get started. So I've never used, I'm really scared I'm gonna mess up. There's a lot of pressure with this, both on from you and from ZoomEd, but that's good. Hopefully it'll turn out better. And luckily you can just get this wet, like if you, once it dries, you can just like cover it in water, I think, and then it'll come up so I can change it. Um, yeah, I guess some of you are still in class. Maybe I should have waited a little longer, but whatever. Oh, well, yeah, um, Indiana Herbs and Ritter said he thought the Sharpie was a crack. I did completely shatter one of my 40 gallons, but I was gonna put Gobi the corn snake in, so. Um, I'm thinking of, also, Amber, she already showed Amber. I'm thinking of getting a 55 gallon for Gobi instead. They're a little more expensive, but I can find them for cheaper, and that would be pretty cool. Okay, so it says, um, <laughs> I haven't actually read this yet. So I did this right. You use this as a little bucket. Let me get the other parts. <clears throat> okay, we got, 
Got a shovel. Um, don't die, froggy frog. Uh, and the video isn't playing for me. Well, I guess he can't hear me. But if you re, someone tell Ethan and Craig to refresh. Um, I'm recording the stream on a Samsung S6 Edge, and then this is a Canon T5i. I want a Sony, but they're expensive. My Instagram is go underscore herping. Okay, so it says, uh, for easy cleanup, do this stuff, and then add, gradually add three cups of water, mix thoroughly, adding one cup at a time until moldable. And then there's different balloons and stuff to make different shapes. So if you're just joining, this will be for my Kenyan Sandbow. The, well, I use three mics, actually. That's the Rode VideoMic Pro, and then I use the Rode SmartLav Plus, and then the Blue Yeti, um, just the Blue Yeti. So I, I use them interchangeably. But most of my recent videos have been with the SmartLav Plus, and then I use the Rode VideoMic Pro for audio syncing, which is kind of unnecessary, but I have it, so I might as well do it. I, might not, I probably don't even need this glove yet. So I'm going to turn this camera on and start adding water. Hopefully this is at least three cups. <clears throat> yeah, I plan on keeping all my animals until they die. Assuming I'm still alive. I mean, the box turtle. Assuming she'll be in good health, she's guaranteed to outlive me. And maybe for the next generation. <laughs> uh, so let me start this camera. I might talk to the camera a little bit, but most of it will just be nice little music montages. So I'm going to add a cup here. Instagram is go underscore herping, like I just said. Was that gradual enough? Maybe that was too fast. Oh, that looks pretty disgusting. <clears throat> Whoa, it's already pretty chunky. Whoa, okay, I'm getting everywhere. Yeah, how many of you do have Kenyan Sandboas? Or how many of you are looking at them? <clears throat> yeah, we know Rise. Um, I am actually going to Repticon uh, Raleigh on Saturday. Okay, we definitely need more water. Rise, don't ask me questions like that. I'm going to start answering them and waste a bunch of time. Because <laughs> that always ends up happening. <laughs> um, this is... I guess it's, um, it's not that exciting right now. I think I need to go in with a glove. Because I don't feel like washing this up. Oh, it just got in the glove and on my hand. What am I doing? Uh, if you just joined, I'm making a background for my sandboa. So in a 20 gallon, and this is excavator clay. It's like, you mold it into whatever you want and then it dries in the place. And I'm kind of looking back and forth at chat in this. This, I don't know if doing this in a box is really the best way to do it, because that, the box is just breaking, even though that's what the instructions show. Let me stop the other camera. I keep getting called by random North Carolina numbers. Hold on, let me cancel it, or decline it. Uh-oh, what just happened? Are you still here? Hopefully it didn't mess up. <laughs> <clears throat> Okay, it's still too dry, I think. Let me see how, here's how it's looking. It smells kind of gross. It smells like a muddy backyard. So many people just scare me. <laughs> Tactical Taco, thank you for the two US dollars. And I have exact, oh. I have a little under three cups. And there we go. Eh. 
and your senpai said, I'm so happy that I stayed home for a mental health day today. <laughs> now I get to watch you. <laughs> well, thank you. And I love taking mental health days. I don't know if that's what I'll call it, but I don't know. I probably shouldn't mention that on a stream with people who should probably be going to school. But sometimes you need a break. An uncalled for break. Okay, so this is probably good. I can probably go ahead and get the enclosure. How long are you gonna stream for? Probably as long as it takes to do the background. The problem is I'm not sure if it's gonna be enough for my idea, so I'm gonna have to change it a little bit. Um, because usually, well, see on the instructions, that looks like a lot in there, right? I guess not really. I don't, it's kind of a lot. I think they used multiple things. This is 12 pounds. So I, yeah, I don't think it's gonna cover the entire background. I'm hoping to have some spots for some plants too. But this will be a very different build. I'm gonna go ahead and get the enclosure. And move everything off the table. And I'm going to just mush all of this into the table so much. But that's okay. And here we go. Whoop, I just got mud on my phone. Here, let me just, okay. Quality organization. People always send me all the weird noises I make when I lift and clean. Okay, so I guess I should put it on the back, on its back. Let me take this glove off. And turn this around. Oh, <laughs> almost knocked you off. Okay. Mud is getting everywhere, so now I'm going to move you around. Also, welcome, people that haven't been here that long. Um, I live... <laughs> am I pregnant? <laughs> do I look pregnant? I don't think I do. Um, well, someone asked, do I lift? I'm not exactly overweight. So <laughs> I do lift. Sonny's like three pounds. I pick him up pretty often. Okay, let me readjust the camera, the other camera. 100% look pregnant, thanks. Yeah, this is for the Kenya Sambo. I have not, Katu. Eh, it's YouTube. See, I, I, I question stream on Twitch, but Twitch probably has weirder people. Well, it's pretty much the same people. Um, okay, so my, oh wait, maybe I shouldn't, see, okay, what I want to do is, this is the bottom of the enclosure, I'm going to have it separated into two types of substrate, and so I want, like, a little stream of this stuff going down the middle, and then up the back, so maybe I should put it the other way. I'm very indecisive, I don't know. I'm gonna turn it around. I only clean one side of this enclosure since the other side will be on the back. Look at this poor table. <clears throat> this is my, my Kenyan Sandbox. Okay, so the question is, should I just like mold it with my hand? Or should I put something there? Potatoes are the foundation of everything. Like name a food that doesn't have potatoes. I guess there's kind of a lot, but so don't name one. Because you'll be naming lots of things. Okay, well see I could mold with my hands or, where is it? 
I have this tube. I'm probably not even going to use the accessories. I can put this tube down and mold over it, but I think that'd be too tall. So I'll just use my hands. Um, uh, yeah, I'll just... Where's my glove? I'm putting my glove back on. Okay, I just got dirt all over the floor and mushed it into the carpet with my foot. Don't tell the house owners that. What if the owners of the house I'm we're renting actually washes? Okay. Um, see any last minute questions before I Gabe Olenek. Olin Gabe. I'll just say Gabe. Thank you so much for the two US dollars. And the intercooter did not make it. We talked about that a few times. Um, our guess, we're still not sure what happened, but our guess is that there was something internal, like internal damage, because there was still no physical changes from when it first happened. And here we go. Oh, wait, I need, did I turn the camera on? Hold on. Okay, now the camera's on. Respond at Exxon. I, I don't see his message. Okay, so I don't know how much I'm going to have, but I'm just going to start motion and make it look natural, I guess. Oh, wait, I didn't finish reading the instructions. I guess there's no more to it than just molding it. Yeah. So this is going to be like a divider. Actually, I might try and like get some little spots carved out of here so that I can put some plants in it. I'm probably just going to do um, like air plants because if I get this wet, it's just going to come up and you can water air plants out of the enclosure. I just don't want to use too much right here because I need to save it for other spots. I'm just going to have to accept that it's going to get everywhere and I'll have to clean it later. I should also probably be glad that I can't see chat right now since I'm on the other side of you. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> This is, uh, yeah, I think, actually, I think it's more than I thought. Zaz, Zaz should be? Zaz, Zaz, Zaz J B. Thank, thank you so much for the 10 US dollars. I really appreciate it. You said, I love your videos. You inspired me to get my ball python and to get a vivarium, which I spent an excessive amount of money on. Uh, are you going full bioactive with your boa? Well, thank you again so much for the super chat. It can, I guess it can help go like towards the plants of this. This one's not gonna actually be bioactive. Um, it will have all live plants, but I really didn't feel the need to go full on it. I could have, I guess, but I'm satisfied with this one not being like that. Okay, is that sufficient? Is that too tall? I think that'll be good. Actually, it looks kind of fake now. I want to look like it naturally uh, formed. This is from my Canyon Sandba. Maybe like that. And then you can see there's dirt on the front, but I'll just clean all that afterwards. I guess that'll work. We'll find out.
And so now what I'm gonna do, well, let's see. I'm, I'm just trying to think that's enough. That's probably enough, maybe. I'll come back to that afterwards if it isn't. So now I'm just gonna change it and put it on its back. Or, um, yeah. Do enclosures have, yeah, enclosures have backs. I hope this doesn't just fall off when I change the position. I think it'll stay. It looks fine right now. I need to pick some mud up off the ground. It's ruining everything. Hold on, I try and do this with one hand. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised it's staying up. It's sticking pretty well, so pretty adhesive. Okay, if you want to join the Discord, we talk about whatever we want. It's, at first it was more of a reptile chat, now it's more just a chat with people that like reptiles. How can I get you at the right angle? This is difficult. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is start building it up. So this is the, going to be the back and it's on its back right now. Discord is like the new version of Skype mixed with TeamSpeak, except it's good. <laughs> oh no, there it goes. Wow, disappointment. I would stop it, but I think I just make it worse. Let's just watch it. <laughs> okay. Well, I. Hmm. <laughs> I think I'll do the background now. I'll just put this amount aside and then I'll let the background um, dry. <laughs> and <laughs> it's not even funny. And then I'll do that part afterwards. So I'm literally just gonna pick this up and put it aside. Wow, all that 10 minutes of hard work. And then I'll come back to it. Anyway, I don't understand how Zuma did this in the video. I'm so scared this is just gonna look like garbage. <laughs> We're gonna find out. Oh wait, I just realized this, this box of substrate is dry on the bottom. I didn't mix it well enough. Maybe that's why the other one fell, it wasn't, it might have been a bit too soft. What if I just leave it like this, just do nothing else, and stick my sand bow in it? Like, I'm trying to mix it more. Stand by. Oh, like I we just dropped like 20 people. Um, the Pac-Man frog would probably hate it. It would also fall off as soon as I spray the enclosure. Okay. Now it's too dry. I think I need to go get more water. You can't even see what I'm doing. I'm trying to mix it more, but see now it's just crumbly. This is excavator clay mixed with water. Uh, you can kind of see the leopard gecko from here. Right there. He's in his moist hide the time being. He spends a lot of his time in that hide, even though the other one is at the proper temperature. Okay, is this... Yeah, it's too dry. Okay, I'll bear back and get more water.
I got more water. And I'm pouring more water in. At this point, we've just ruined everything and we're making it up. This is a 20 gallon log, so pretty standard. Same one as that and that. Is there enough water? It's getting there. There's always a debate. <clears throat> okay, and um, you have the worst view right now. Oh no, I think I added too much water. <laughs> we got it, hold on. I'm not giving up yet. And I just realized this just tore through my glove. It's completely pointless now. Is that hair on the clay? I don't see any hair. You're talking about the blue stuff, it's um Sharpie. So I want to build this up a little bit more so I can fit plants in it. I think it, it definitely won't cover the entire back. The hard thing is I'm trying to do this like upside down in a weird 90 degree angle. We good, we got it. Also, I might use a balloon, because they sent some balloons. <laughs> okay, yeah. So I'll get a balloon and show you how that works. I'm also gonna turn the camera back on. So, Let's see if this works. I'm just gonna take the glove off. Because as you can see, <laughs> it's not working. Michael, are you here? Because this is all your fault. Wait, do I have eyelids? Or a different per- Oh, can you- <laughs> Okay. And a balloon. Let's see how this- See, I wanna- Try and record both- You can't even see me right now, because of that light. Um, let me get some extra shots. <laughs> okay. And these are like the hardest videos to record because I don't really know what to shoot. <laughs> I feel there's so much pressure right now. There's so <laughs> There's 70 people watching me just blow up a balloon, or 80 people. <laughs> Here, I'm turning. Okay, that might be good. So I can, if I put it right here, I should be able to make a little spot for it. Why am I getting tons of, oh, why are you getting tons of new subscribers? I didn't do anything this time. <laughs> I 
could have splashed my phone number. I don't think my phone number is anywhere. Oh, I d oh, no, I did. I shouldn't have acknowledged that. Anyway, just gonna ignore that. Um, this might be too large. No, I think it'll work. And so I'm just gonna <laughs> dig a spot out. <clears throat> so what this is for, I guess I should also record this. It, I feel like it's gonna pop from the pressure. Basically, you pull the balloon out um, after it deflates, because it'll hold its position long enough. Zolder, I shouldn't say it out loud, because I'll get demonetized, but they do have quite the interesting color choice with these balloons. It's, is there still not enough? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna get pee to your phone number. I really want to know how many Peter representatives saw the video. It has to be at least a few, because when you search PETA, it's one of the first results for me. Or PETA reptiles or something. This, I'm not going to have enough of this stuff. I did not watch the movie. I also just don't like movie theaters. There's too many people. I say as I stream in front of like 80 of them. We get in there. I'm really scared this balloon's gonna pop. This is, look at how thin that is. It's gonna crack this wall I'm trying to make. I don't know, it might work. We're gonna find out today. I really want, I think actually pet rock sellers already exist. If someone could just make the most genuine professional pet rock site, I will buy from you. Yeah, I know Magical Miranda, it's, I love Zuma's products, but they need better color options. We know it doesn't look like a balloon. <laughs> we Thank you for the additional two dollars. Or I think four dollars, because I missed your other one. Will that work? I don't know if it'll work. We have more balloons slash other items. Um, I might use another. Maybe put one like down here. <laughs> I'll get another. We can do a larger one. <laughs> I hate making this commentary so much. <laughs> Um, let's just see how large the larger one is. See, here's, here we go. <laughs> Don't, no, no. I'm not crying, I guess. <laughs> I'm crying on the inside. I guess I could do that. I would just use another small one, it'll be easier. You know what, I just realized I had these balloons on the table with dead rats. And now I'm putting them in my mouth. I, I don't have any good wording to pick from right now. I'm deleting my channel. Very difficult. <laughs> well, what I will tell you is, I have I. God, only it's. I'm just cringy thinking about it. When I was like 12, I made a Vine account, and 12 year old me was quite the weeaboo, weeaboo. So maybe at a certain milestone, I should release my entire Vine compilation. It's I think a half hour of 13 year old me talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> no.
No, 40,000 is too close. That's the issue. Okay. I should do it. And I need to wipe my hand real quick. I would love a tegu someday, but I don't think I can take a tegu and a savannah monitor at the same time right now. Okay, let me tie this. <clears throat> and here we go. Oh, this is so difficult. You can't see anything either. Let me turn it around. That's probably a mistake, but... Hi, welcome to the stream, people that are new here. Yeah, the substrate, it smells worse than it looks, too. Well, I mean, it looks... Once it's done, it'll look good. But... Okay, we did it. Yeah, these are balloons. According to ZooMed. People are conspiracizing other things. So I'll probably put this one in the corner right here. And if you don't know, this is the bottom of the enclosure. So like we have it on its back right now. <clears throat> and here we go. I guess I'm just glad that I wasn't wasn't alone thinking that when I opened the Zoom Ed box. We're getting that. So if you see what we're doing, we're making like little caves and we're gonna put plants in these. I'll probably fill them with sand and put some air plants. Um, who knows? Maybe some like. This is thing is like desert moss. Well, it's like the desert equivalent to moss, just like a filler plant that looks nice. Because that, that could be kind of cool. And then once the, once you're done, you can either, or once it's dry, you can either pop the balloons or let them deflate and take them out. Uh, because they're actually made to, well, they said you can do whatever you want with them. God, I shouldn't say that. Um, you can do whatever you want with them in the enclosure. <laughs> and, but they're also made to make like little caves for your animals. So I've already used like half of the substrate or half of whatever this is. <clears throat> yeah, maybe, well, the NSFW part on the Discord, it's pretty vanilla. Cause we technically don't allow real NSFW stuff. Since it's par partially my reputation that like brands see when they find my channel. This is a 20 on long. It looks bigger cause you're inside it. And this is for my Kenny Sandbar. Oh, hi, hi, Gary Three. You were, you were. I know you are. A, what's it called? A, a super chatter before. There should be like YouTube needs some ranks. Where like if you send a super chat, you get a little special name or something. Actually, they're going to be expanding the subscriptions thing. Right now, it's just for gamers, or like paid subscriptions. So if I just transform my channel to a gaming channel I can you can subscribe for five bucks a month and give me free money for this enclosure I should actually thank the patrons in this video because they'll definitely be a help when I buy some other stuff for it <clears throat> um can you do a video on the BioDudes products? They're quite expensive, but I'm sure you can work out a sponsorship. I don't know if, I'm, I'm not sure if I actually mentioned this. We actually agreed on one. And then I never got sent anything. <laughs> or I'm not sure if we, he, I didn't like mention products yet, but I like lost contact with them. So rip. They look, still look like good products though. But. Okay, I think I need even more water. We're getting there, though. Can you do a video on eco-earth? 
I wonder if I could do a full video on it, but, but, um, we've talked about Eco-Earth a lot. Okay, I need more water, so I'll bear it back again. I keep abandoning you. I've used like six cup of water, six, five or six cups of water, but it's working, I think. <clears throat> How do you get sponsorships with a company? I have tons of reptiles, so I could make some sort of insane uh, content. Just need stuff to review. Um, what I always do with that kind of thing is direct you to a channel named Roberto Blake. If you look that up, because he's like the master at YouTube SEO and marketing and sponsorships. Because I don't have enough experience in that to actually give you tips. Welcome back, Ethan. Uh, if all your animals got into a battle royale ring fight, who would win? That's a good question. Probably, Olive's pretty vicious if she wants to be. It would probably be her. <clears throat> would you stop making fun of Zuma's poor balloons? They're just trying to do a reptile related job. I'm still scared they're gonna pop because this is getting heavy. I'm putting a lot of pressure on them. Well, not, not being funny though, they probably are made of latex because they are very squishy, and it'll keep them from popping while I do this, and not like cheap other balloon stuff. The monitor does not have a name. I haven't even like, thought of any. So give me some name ideas. We are getting there. So here, let's step back. I'll show you the, oh, there's Franklin. Hi, Franklin. Oh, he's asleep. <laughs> Uh, here's the top view. So it'll look like this. And I'll try and extend more without dripping dirt. I'll try and extend it more that way. And maybe make a few more pockets. So I'll go ahead and do that now. And then if you are new here, I had a nice piece that was right there and it fell off. <laughs> so I'm going to do that later. And save this and put it to the side. Just so I know how much I need for later. Should work. <clears throat> this is for the Kenyan sand boa, Ember. P is a good name. Uh, okay. Okay, so when I do this line, I might actually put it up a little bit and not even do it there to save dirt because substrate will come up a couple inches at least. So yeah, if you, I guess I should reintroduce the video in case you haven't been here for that long. Uh, I'm making another vivarium with Zoomed products that they sent over. There'll be multiple full videos on it. This is just a stream because this part takes a while and it's a good time to talk. Um, and I'm also recording some parts at the same time. Uh, Kevin, Squishy, Jeffy, Manza. Going through modern names, Fluffy, Cornelius, Raymond, Fred, <laughs> Spaghetti, or Spaghetti. I'm not sure if that was a purposeful typo or not. Cade, Frank, Pico, Kenneth, Kenitha, Mushroom, <laughs> Lenny, Monitor, make monitor face. Rakeem, chameleon, chameleon? Is, oh, that's, yeah. Tim, Bill, Kai, Francis, Delilah, Scrollmaster, Chaka, there's so many names. I'll stop saying them and I'll keep reading them. 
to keep them in mind. I take way too long to name the animals. Henry, Timmy, Oliver Ogbar, very nice, very nice. Um, oh, I didn't even finish what I was saying. So this is a, gonna be a, a desert vivarium for the Kenyan sandbar with almost all Zumet products. This is the Zumet ex excavator clay. And we're almost there to the end. I'm just gonna basically keep going until I run out. I might do another balloon um, on the other side. Maybe she's, no, the tube won't work. Okay. Let me wrap my hands again. Just wipe it in here. And we've got another one of these. The problem is these are really a much different size, so I don't know how it's gonna work. It also tastes like dirt, if you're wondering. That's too large. Too large. Will that work? That might work. I'll try that. Because well, I have to blow the balloon up. I don't have a pump. Uh-oh, low battery. I'm gonna have to plug my phone in. Stop quoting everything I say with poor intentions. I'm having a lot of trouble tying this. And just lost some air and now there's dirt all over it. Is this edible? Zoom ed. This better be edible. Oh, that tastes disgusting. <laughs> and... Still too big. <laughs> I can't get the right size. Mmm. <laughs> Tasty. This is for the Kenyan Sandbar. <laughs> I'm, I guess I need to show you what I'm doing. I'm, I'm not eating the clay on purpose. I'm, Blowing the balloon up so that I can tie it. We did it. Okay, I'm gonna go get my charger. Before I lose you. Hopefully the fan doesn't overheat. <clears throat> Are we charging? Yep, we're charging. Uh, I should probably calculate the price to see. Well, I'm I'm gonna pay for like the plants and stuff. <clears throat> <clears throat> I need some water. Okay, here we go. Gonna this balloon grow while I was gone? This is way bigger than I intended. And that'll work. I put it like right here, towards the corner. I can put like a nice big plant there. The monitor is we don't know yet. It has to grow more until we know the actual gender. Can't be assumed assume in genders. Why does it still say low battery? I thought it was charging. I think it is AS yeah, charging. If it suddenly goes out, it's because my battery went out and my charger's not fast enough. Ooh, I just swallowed another chunk of dirt. Not a chunk, but a little bit that was still in my mouth. Also, I'm adding more water. This is, uh, I was much more organized the first like 20 minutes. Now my arm is getting tired. <laughs> because I forgot that when you tell the internet not to do something, it's the only thing that they do. Uh, Caleb, that is, let me turn the other light back on. Ooh, look at that, that's better. <clears throat> Brian, BB005, uh, $5 via Super Chat. Great job, I'm new to the channel. Do you rec 
do you recommend a heat pad on the side of the tub for doobie riches? Thank you so much for the $5 super chat. Uh, my heat mat's on the bottom, but it works just fine on the side because they don't like me to actually get belly heat. They just need heat going into the enclosure, so the side works fine. That's probably safer because it's not on a direct surface. Did you like the memes I sent you? I got, I in one of my videos in the comments, I said, send me a good meme or two as the pin comment. And a lot of people sent some weird stuff. I enjoyed most of them. So I probably enjoyed it. I'm not sure which one you were though. We're getting, I'm kind of scared I'm gonna run out now. We're gonna find out. How do I send you memes? Well, I actually just said it because I wanted more people to check out my Instagram, and it worked. Um, but you can direct message them to me, I guess, via Instagram. I have the link below, but... <clears throat> it's go underscore herping. I still want go herping, just at go herping. Maybe if I get the name trademarked, I could take it. Because no one even posts on it. I'm sure we've all experienced that. <laughs> I guess you can email me memes. It's usually used as a business account, but memes work too. Where did your name come from? I'm guessing you mean the Go Herpy name. Um, well, originally the name was completely different. And then I realized I was focusing a lot on herping itself and just reptile care. So I changed it to go herping because it's very generic. So like, but not taken. So I wanted something generic and easy to remember. But then whoops, at the same time, I don't really herp that much now. <laughs> it's mostly just herpetoculture, but it works. So here's what we got left. We're running out. We're getting there. Uh, so do you have to pay Patreon to use their service uh, to make extra dollar, dollar bills? They take a certain percentage. They take like 9% or something. This, for anyone just joining, this is from my Kenyan sand boa. It's going to be a complete vivarium build. I don't have the plants yet. But once this dries tomorrow, I can do the other parts. Probably tomorrow. And there'll be a full video with some specific product reviews. Because I have a bunch of other stuff from them. Oh, herping is when you go out and find reptiles. Like, fishing is when you go out and catch fish. Herping is finding reptiles and catching reptiles and amphibians. A little more water I'm going to add. The stream is calmed down now. I just had to ignore 80% of the questions for the first hour, or first half hour. Is that as Jabi? <laughs> I don't know how to say your name. Thank you so much for the additional two dollars via super chat. Dumpster diving tips: um, make sure it's legal. Uh, my mate. Well, one of my tips is to be obvious. Like, don't try and hide. Like, I purposely would wave or say hi to any workers around, and they didn't care. But it's less suspicious when you actually confront them, even though I hate confronting people. And what else? Uh, one person told me they throw needles in the dumpster sometimes. So I guess be careful where you step and wear good gear, unlike me. And just don't, don't, I don't know. <laughs> what else is there to dumpster diving? Just search carefully and hold your breath. We are, I'm trying to cover this entire balloon. Again, balloon, but um, I'm having trouble because I'm running out. Yeah, don't touch weird. Don't touch weird stuff in the dumpsters. It's kind of, uh, yeah, I'm having flashbacks. I mean, where else is the employee's old lunch gonna go? I don't know what I expected, but I didn't need to smell it. <clears throat> Yeah, well, see, I, I made a YouTube channel so I can just be away from people and 
and do my own thing, but then whoops, that attracted people. <laughs> Uh, someone said, why do I? <laughs> no, this is, look at how strong that is. You got no problems. No accidents happening today. Um, someone asked why I sound tired all the time. I don't know. Because I am. <laughs> We're getting there, look at that. There's, yeah, there's not gonna be enough for like tunnels, but I'd be more comfortable not doing tunnels anyway. Um, because, uh, then you, then I don't have to, like, lose my Korean Sanbo in this. I'm 17. It's weird, my battery's staying exactly 8%. Every time it goes down one from the stream, it goes up one from my battery. I mean, from my charger. I just need to, I need to just change my name to Go Herping. I'm 17. Well, my age will change, but... And stuff. I'm gonna actually probably record an FAQ today with the questions that I get literally on a daily basis. Like, how old are you? You're able to drive? Um, what's your favorite reptile? What else do people always ask? Um, what happened to the snake eggs? What happened to the river cooter? Uh, um, what else do people ask? Uh, no, none of the balloons have popped. They're holding them in there. I just need to finish that balloon right there and get it completely covered. Oh boy. I don't think I have enough in there. Enough stuff around it. It's probably gonna end up falling. The balloons are, um... So, to anyone that doesn't know, I have this on its side right now, so it'll be the other way, but it's going to make, like, little uh, divots in it so I can put plants in there. I just have to make sure it's plants that don't need any water <laughs> because water will mess this up. But that's probably what I'm going to do, air plants. What, pe what sites do you suggest that I get plants from, everyone? Preferably air plants or bromeliads. Because there's definitely a lot. I'm looking at glass box tropicals. But I don't know. We are almost there. Wait, I keep putting it here. I need to put it here. Oh boy, I hope this is strong. It's getting difficult. Oh yeah, that's my other frequently asked question. Do you live by yourself? No, I, I'm not like trying to be salty towards you, but I don't know why everyone thinks that. I'm not even, they all, everyone thinks I look 14, so I don't know how I live by myself. <laughs> how much Minecraft <laughs> do you play per day? I actually, when I bought it a couple years ago, I got bored of it in like an hour. Normal Minecraft, that's where I can waste some time. You look 10. Well, when I was 13, people thought I was 9. So, it stays about even. I guess I'm just always 4 years younger. Or maybe I'm lying every time. Can both of it in that tank? Do you mean a boa? What? I feel like you, I'm 14 and I thought, and someone thought I was 10. Welcome to the club. <laughs> it has its perks sometimes. You get the kids meals, which are cheaper. Might be enough, maybe. Maybe I need more support. I don't know how strong this is.
Well, people say I sound, or like, apparently I seem like I'm an adult, but I look like I'm four. Am I out of water again? I'm gonna have to use like 10 cups. <laughs> How long is this gonna take? <laughs> we just passed the one hour mark. I could do it way faster if I wasn't talking to you, but it's a bit more fun. Let me make sure everything else is looking good. That's still holding, still not popping. Maybe I should like stick a ceramic heat emitter on it to just dry it more quickly. Very nice, very nice. <clears throat> I'm not popping our protection. We need it to protect the enclosure. I wish I used excavator clay for mine. Yeah, I think it'll it'll be kind of cool to have a different look because I usually use eco earth on the back, or just well, I guess I've only done one background. <laughs> okay, why don't we stay? I'm getting tired actually. Yeah, there's hundred plus people here. To anyone that hasn't joined, we're making a a background for a Kenyan for the Kenyan sandbo because I only have one. Um. And it's, yeah, just rewatch the stream if you want more context. Okay, so you can see. I'm, I'm also running out of stuff to say. I was doing pretty good for the first half hour. I had a, but now I'm just running out of things to talk about. Give me more topics that won't get me demonetized. Uh, this will look so much nicer than the tank with nothing but aspen. Yeah, that's true. Well, hopefully it will. My glove tore. It's... Here's my glove. It tore on all the mud got inside. Talk about sunny. Mmm, sunny is... You can see the corner of his enclosure right there. He is, uh... Um, oh, well, it's almost December, so I've almost had him for four years. So I got him December 11th, I think? December 15th? And I think I need more water. Okay, time for more water. I'll be back again. getting there oh boy so yeah we'll have space for three plants so if I can get enough on here I'll do a face reveal at a hundred thousand very nice a very nice yeah I'm my only can well I have a lot of concerns about this I'm scared I'm gonna mess it all up but my main concern is this when I take the or when I put it on its side or on its bottom how it's supposed to be I'm scared it's gonna fall apart which of course I'll wait until it's dry which will probably take like a day but... how do you know that was my face okay that's probably good like that and then I'll put some here and try and fill that last part I have one balloon left, but I don't have enough dirt left. Look at this progress. 
the weird thing is I don't really get how it sticks to the glass. What if, what if when it's dry I just put it on its, the way it's supposed to be and the entire thing just falls forwards? Uh, Spencer said sugar, sugar daddy is feeling dejected from no response. Thank you for your two Canadian dollars. I will continue to deject. Okay. Also, I just realized I basically built this entire thing by looking through a screen. Maybe I should actually look without the screen. Yeah, the middle's a bit empty. I expected that. If I fill this part all the way to the top, I'll just use the leftovers to see just how high I can get right here. And then the bottom will be Two types of substrate. Stop for a sec. Are you telling me to stop or everyone else to stop? Jeff, thank you so much for the two Canadian dollars. Oh wait, I sure I'm not even showing you the, the thing that I'm building. I don't know what angle to do now. Because I, I just had the phone in the enclosure, but now I can't really. <sighs> Even if I'm not done in like 10 minutes, I'm just going to stop the stream. Because <laughs> I'm getting tired. But either way, I appreciate everyone joining. Let's see how long I last. Let's see. Well, what do we accomplish in this hour? We talked about the enclosure. We talked about Discord, which you can join at the link in the description. We also, I, I submitted a Discord application and it got <laughs> rejected. <laughs> um, we leaked my phone number. Anything else? I'm supposed to say my name, Jeff. Sorry. <laughs> say it harder. Just say it softer. My name is Jeff. I check my DMs a lot, but people send a lot of DMs, and it's hard to respond to them on the phone. That was quite the salty response, I'm sorry. I'm getting salty and sweaty, which gives me more salt because it's what is salty. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if it would be kind of cool if Discord was somehow integrated into the app because I can't actually use any other apps while I'm live streaming. Okay, I'm just patting this over and over. It's getting there. Here, let's have another front look. Oh god, there's so much dirt on the ground. Don't tell anyone. Okay. See, so that's how it'll actually look. From this angle. I'm gonna have some nice, beautiful plants. Do you think I could put another balloon? Here, I'm just gonna dump all the substrate out and see how much I have left. If I can use the phone with one hand. <laughs> Probably make me nauseous. Hold on. I just have to accept that my phone's gonna get covered in excavator clay. How's that? Is that sufficient? Could do another balloon. Let's use the last balloon, shall we? Got the final one right here. <laughs> I 
I can't do it. This is the last thing I want to put my mouth on now, thanks to all of you, and because it tastes like dirt still. <laughs> okay, there we go. And it's gonna have to be small though. Smaller. Smaller. Okay. That might be good. I could put it up high. Maybe there's some sort of hanging plant I could do. Ugh, okay, here we go. We do all types of tutorials here. I'm gonna start on it now. Mmm, <sighs> tasty. Mmm. <laughs> it tastes like just like straight flour that's been just sitting in the earth forever. We do it. We got it. What kind of shape is that? What happened? Okay. This is probably too much air. Maybe if I like push it down. <laughs> now I'm just gonna dump it up the dirt on. There's not enough water. Look at that consistency. <clears throat> yeah, honestly, the, the flavor isn't as bad as I thought. I give the Zuma Excavator Clay a, a 7 out of 10 taste. Sorry, I'm not even talking anymore. I'm, you know how much energy I have most of the time. Now I have even less energy. Oh no, anyone that's still left is probably doesn't even care. I feel like the group gets more genuine as the stream goes on. Or maybe it's just people that have less stuff to do. Why is that so dry? We almost there. I wonder if that's enough to hold a plant. Probably not. I'm gonna steal a tiny bit of this dirt that I was saving. Wow, don't talk about my hand like that. Um, and then just put a little bit here. It's very cold now. You can actually make little termite mounds out of this. I'm very surprised these balloons have not popped. At least like one of them. I, this isn't gonna collapse on the animals in it. Well, I've never used this, but I just need to wait for it to dry probably for about a day. And apparently it 
will stay. <laughs> it basically hardens like rock. And then it's malleable, maldable, what's the word? When you get it wet again. So you just don't spray the enclosure. <clears throat> okay. I've got like one handful left. So you know what really irritates me is I was expecting to have lots of empty spots. So I was like, okay, whatever. But now there's only one small empty spot. So now it's really going to bother me. I would rather there be a lot of emptiness or no emptiness. What should we do about this? Hmm. We have almost none left. <laughs> Can you stream when you pop the balloons? <laughs> It, it will probably have to be tomorrow. And I'll put it on my Instagram story or something. At go underscore herping. I think we might be good. An hour, 16 minutes, and we may be done. Someone says too dry. I don't know if it is. I've never used this, but... I, I do need to add a little more because this... Part right here is Oop, too much. Wow, what a great sound that is! Oh no, I just realized I've been digging dirt into the ground. We're so close. Yeah, this is really annoying. Look at that little spot right there. Hmm. What should I do about that? We were so close. And this spot's fine because there'll be substrate here. I guess I could maybe take a little bit of this because there will be substrate takes something like that. Franklin is over there. Can I zoom in? Wee, look at that. He's asleep right now. Uh, yeah, leopard gecko is right over there, Goldie. Are we good? Maybe. So what does everyone think of it? Let's get another view of the front and get your opinion. There we go. <sighs> we have to like not do anything else today, I'm getting... It's, it's mostly because these lights are so hot, but I need them for this camera. And there's two of them. And there's no, no ceiling fan. Yeah, I might take a little bit of dirt from down here. I get everything off Amazon. <laughs> the the lighting is just from Amazon. If you're in the description, there should be a link to like my supplies and gear, and it's linked in the YouTube kit there. It's pretty cheap actually. It's not the best lights, but it's like sixty dollars for both. Usually something like that would be like two hundred plus dollars. If you want to get really fancy, like two hundred dollars per light. Uh, this is for the Kenyan sand boa. Yeah, anyone that hasn't been here. Is anyone here? How long has everyone been watching? Has anyone been here the whole time? Um, I'm doing another vivarium build with Zoomed. So this is for the Kenyan sand boa. Uh, com basically completely different from my last one. Last one was very tropical. This one will be very deserty, And hopefully it comes out well. But today, I just spent an hour and a half doing this background. I think it'll look good though. I've never used excavator clay. Uh, 
Okay. We're out of balloons. And I'm out of clay. So. Well, I have this amount of clay, though. And then I'm going to use, use this part to do the little separator right there. So maybe we're done here. Is there anything else? And I'll try and find a bunch of different plants. But maybe we're done. Uh, I probably should show the Kenyan Sandboa. I don't need to wipe my hand off them. So I think I'm just going to leave it like this. Actually, do you think that's going to stay? Of course it'll be dry, but I'm scared it's going to crack. Maybe if I like spray it a little bit. I don't know. I'm just going to leave this now. I'm going to wipe my hands off. And it is, <laughs> you can't see anything. Oh, I need paper towel. Uh, the wire racks, I got them from Home Depot. I'm actually going to get more racks, a different, larger type. They should be in the mail now. Um, and, yeah. Actually, you should probably just go on Amazon. Home Depot is overpriced. Not overpriced, but it's just a pain, because then you have to pick it up yourself. Oh, yeah, whoops, I did a face reveal before 100000 Um... Why is it when I talk, the chat moves fast and my message doesn't get seen? Oh, did you say something? Okay, so now I'm basically clean with dirt all over the floor and the table and the enclosure, so that's good. Take our battery pack. And I'm not going to lift it. I'm probably going to leave it overnight or at least until like 2 a.m. Maybe I'll come back on streaming later if there's more to do. Let's see if we can see the sand boa. Uh, no, she's probably, in, oh, well, there's her face. Right there. Can you see it? <laughs> Hold on. How do I get chat to go away? Wait, where'd she go? Can't do it. Okay. And I think we're done. Any last words from anyone? We can do the 125. Yeah, that enclosure said. Oh, this enclosure? Yeah, this one's. I see some of my enclosures are like super lame right now, because I don't want to put a bunch of time into them yet until I really get like their full time, like full time forever enclosures. So Shadow and Gobi will be the next upgrade. Um, wait, did I? Oh, I missed the Super Chat. Is it Zaz to be? <laughs> I can't stop saying it like that. At 50,000, make a montage of blowing up Zoom and balloons. Uh, well, I'm not going to say no or yes, but that's a thing. And two Canadian dollars from Spencer. I, I can't tell what this emoji are supposed to resemble. But thank you for your money. This is for Ember the Canadian Sandboa. And I'm just waiting for it to 25 and then I'll end it. Follow on Instagram at go underscore herping and join the Discord. And thanks for joining and talking about weird stuff. And okay, bye.